Hi, Brad from WordPressSites.net. Uh, this is just an introduction to the new WooCommerce uh, plugin. It's a free e-commerce plugin for WordPress, and I'll just run you through all the different features and settings over the next five minutes, and just show you how simple it is to uh, to set up because it really does integrate well with the existing uh, WordPress uh, system. Here we are here in the back end, I've just uh, installed the plugin and uh, you can see on the left hand side we've got WooCommerce settings, reports, orders, coupons and then we've got some product uh, some, some product tabs here uh, which, are, which are very very easy to use. There's a lot of different settings here but it's not confusing really, it's, it's not difficult to use at all, it's, it seems very very easy and I think the reason because of that is uh, is because it, uh, it it integrates very well with WordPress. It's, it's that's the way it's designed. So uh, basically, you just choose your country here, the the, the allowed countries that you can ship to. Um, if you're using physical products, and you've got all the other settings here, are pretty pretty straightforward. Uh, you've got light box which is really good so your images will, will pop up in a light box uh, you can enable uh, the demo store on your site so you can uh, test everything really well uh, share this if you're a share this publisher you can enter your information there now the Google Analytics is really simple here you just put your Google Analytics ID in there and you can enable tracking um, and e-commerce tracking as well, so that's really, really simple. Uh, moving on to pages, there's a lot of different options here with pages and page setup. It's, it's, uh, you can see how many different options there, but the uh, to choose from. But the the default settings are normally the way to go. Um, <coughs> you've got the different pages: your cart page, checkout page, paid page, thanks page, email address page. You know, you've got all these different pages to choose from. You'll have to set up. Uh, you'll have to set up some of these pages, but it's, uh, it's it's very very easy to set up. Here with your catalog images, um, you know you've got a lot of different sizes to choose from. It's just really simple to set up here. Pricing options. You you, uh, you can choose from the currency there. Uh, currency position so that's all very easy you can manage your stock too as well your inventory if you've got physical products uh, it's got a built-in shipping calculator you can enable that on the cart page you can collect tax as well if you need to add that on as well uh, if you've got physical products you'll need to enable shipping so you've got lot, lots of options there and it's really really easy to set up payment gateways uh, backs You've got check if you if you want to use check or you can just set up check just to test it and you've got PayPal as well so that's really basic to set up. There's a, there's a whole range of other different uh, payment gateways um, and and they've produced about 11 premium extensions so there's lots of other things you can add to this as well. In the report section here, um, there's got a lot of sales data that you can check out. Top earners, top sellers, product sales, monthly sales, daily sales, and it all comes up here. So it's really nice, it's really large, it's really easy to monitor. Uh, also your customer information, you've got quick access to that as well. Um, how many sales and so on, and also stock control. If you've got physical product, you can uh, you can you can check on that easily. You can also add orders uh, manually as well, uh, and basically just click on add new order. Uh, you can put in the customer billing information, the shipping address, all the order details here. Um, so that's really you know it's, it, it integrates perfectly within WordPress. Adding coupons is very easy as well. You just click on Add Coupon and you just you just put the information in there. So that's really easy. You can choose between cart discount, uh, a flat rate, uh, or a percentage on the cart, or, or a specific product dis discount as well. Adding products is just adding like adding a new post in WordPress. If you know how to do that, you can add a product because it's the same setup. You've got all the features available in the WordPress editor. Uh, and then you've got all this extra information down here for the products, so uh, tax inventory, attributes, upsells, cross-sells as well, so you've got a lot of great information and flexibility there. 
You can download the free plugin from my site WordPress sites.